Welcome to my Core 2 OCR June 2010 video. We're going to be looking at question one. So if you read the question, we've got a cubic polynomial and it's called f of x. Now you'll notice that we've got a's in our polynomial, which you might not be used to. This just means that a is representing a constant and you can see that question i asks you to find the value of this constant. Okay, so don't be put off too much. So, the question tells us that x minus 2 is a factor. Now, if you've learnt your factor theorem, that means that f of 2 equals 0. So, what we're going to do is substitute 2 into our equation for x. So, everywhere you've got x, put 2 instead. Okay. Obviously, we don't know a yet, so we're going to leave that as a. And we can simplify this to 8 plus 4a minus 2a, and don't forget minus 14. And we know that this equals 0 from the, the factor theorem. So when we simplify, we get that 2a um, minus 6 equals 0. Add 6, divide by 2, a is 3. Okay, so that's the first part answered. Part two says, um, use this value of a. So now in your equation, you know what a is equal to. It's three. Find the remainder when f of x is divided by x plus one. The remainder theorem says that if we find f of minus one, because it's plus one here, then the answer we get is the remainder, okay? So, what we do is we substitute in the value of minus 1 for x. And we now know what a is, so we substitute that in as well. And you've got a calculator. I don't have one here. Um, so, you can put it into your calculator, or you can figure it out yourself. But do not make any mistakes. And we get the answer of minus 9. OK, so that is our remainder. Hope this has helped. Thanks for watching and thank you for those of you who have subscribed. Achieve Maths.